Hi, I'm Samma's chilli oil and hot sauces and I'm going to pass it over to Samma to tell us about her range of sauces and how she came to make these. So over to you, tell us about your range. Okay, yes, so I, this actually the chilli oils are the very first products I made because this belonged to a dear old lady okay. who made the oils and she made it as really labour of love and giving it out to friends and family. And this actually recipe, unfortunately she passed away, but this actually came to me in a dream. So I had a dream of her one night making it, showing me because she had promised to give me the recipe before she, unfortunately she didn't. So, and then um, the recipe then came to me in 2009. So I started making it just as a labor of love for friends and, and family as well. And just like hers? Just like hers. Before I got it in the dream, I tried to replicate the recipe, did everything because she was making it for me as well. Yeah. She would bring five liters from Cameroon because she's, she's a Cameroonian. And then, so she, that's how um, I started Started making this so it didn't become a business it wasn't a business it was just something I love making yeah. love sharing with friends and family then in 2017 it was costing me money to make it for, for people I decided I was just going to try it out and then and that's why it's named after the old lady so her name was Mama Sama we all used to call her oh, so this right. is like a legacy and the name is, is for her you know just to, yeah. to go on so now I started making it so that I can also share the love the way she loved you know how good food bring people together Yes. So, but now it has evolved from the chili because when I was making the chili oil, I finally realized that I was wasting a lot of byproducts yes. from the um, chili oil. So I said, well, we used to make this at home, so why not use the byproducts to exactly, create yeah. my own um, sauces? And that's how the sauces. So these are actually unique to me. These are my recipes. Um, so I started with just the classic chili chili sauce. And the chili, the classic chili sauce is just basically, I make them from fresh ingredients just as used to make them. So there's no, there's no frozen um, ingredients, no fermented chili, no IQF, they are just fresh chilies. What? Oh, you've yeah. got scotch bonnets. Yeah, yeah they're, they're all scotch, scotch bonnets. They're all scotch bonnets. That's bonnet. why they've got that colour. Yeah, that's going to so, Yeah, used. because they're fruity and buttery yeah. once it's done. And uh, so that was the very first one I made. And then I started like playing with flavours, using the flavours that I like. And then I came up with the um, garlic and ginger was next. Of this course. This is my <laughs> best seller. Yeah. yeah the depth of flavours in that. You know, and I then... I can just always taste that, you yeah, know. Scotch bonnets, garlic, garlic, ginger. Garlic, ginger, amazing. Mm -hmm. And then I then did lemon and thyme, which one? So how do you use them? The oil is really versatile. With the oil, you can use them in your stir fry. Um, you can have it in your soup. You can um, just drizzle it. You can add it to your vinaigrette, balsamic nice vinegar. Yeah, they're really, really nice. Really nice. And, and you've got all bits showing in there. Yeah, and the colors that you see, they are just Vibrant. the colors from the chili. So sometimes they are, the colors come out red because the chilies are very red. Yeah. And sometimes you get the orangey, scotch bonnet, habanero kind of you know, color, so they come out like this. And so it depends on the batch of um, chilies I have, that's the color you get. And you've got this lovely, really yeah, nice this little, gift pack. Yeah, that is, so, that is so cute. And, and they do fly out because yeah. people like them to give them as gifts. Gifts, and, they're beautiful. Yeah. And so you have all the flavors that yeah. we do in there. And so you can drizzle the oil, you can add to your vinaigrette, balsamic vinegar to make it to you know to dip with your bread. You marinate the meat. With you marinate well? so you, you eat so. meat. Yes. You add I them to like well. dark soy sauce mm -hmm. to marinate your meat for your grill or your or, uh, barbecue. And also you can use them as an accompaniment as well. You add it to your um, to mayonnaise or natural yogurt yeah, and it's so marinate versatile. your chicken. They are so so versatile. And the chili jellies. And the chili jellies are made from apple. There's no gelatin in them. Oh, nice so, one. So, so you can have it with your chili. Yeah, so all the products are like vegan friendly. There's no additives. There's no. Um, <laughs> It's a nice yeah. chili isn't it? So they're, yeah. very, they, they, they're delicate, so they're not like the chili jelly you get in the store that way you have to saw through them. Yeah. You know, they, <laughs> they're really nice. You can have oh, that in your one. cheese, yeah. Your smashed like avocado this one. in your wrap. Seeds yeah. in it, look. Seeds, yes, yes. Seeds that's the hot there. one. That's got um, a bit of ghost, ghost peppers, the scotch bonnet, and then the flavors are insane. 
Okay, so, I'm going to yes. put that one there. So, now. Okay, that's so yeah, so you can, you can just use them. They are versatile in your pasta sauce, in your bolognese, in your slow cook. Everything. In everything. Yeah. Because, you know, like you can imagine in Africa years ago, mm. where decades, 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 decades ago, um, you make do with what you have. So you can you basically use two ingredients, three ingredients, you yes. know, to create different uh, um, things. So that I still kept their stick kept simple, clean, just as the home. Natural, I make yeah, them in our garage good. now. Okay, I've graduated from the kitchen to my garage, but you know, so these flavors are still the same. No additives, no, it's, they are dairy free, they are gluten free. I love your passion they're for it as well because, you're because so I about making love these, making yeah? them. No, like I was up till three o'clock in the morning making this, and I come out, it's like I'm fresh because I just love. You know, I, I make it with the you know with love and with care. Passion, I, I, yeah, yeah, with passion. Enjoy I enjoy it. And also, them. obviously, your range will only increase, won't it? So yes. As time goes on, we'll probably see more different. Yeah, that's these, exactly. I have rose pepper flavor, which is not here today because yeah. I didn't have the energy to make them. That might yeah, be a so, popular one because yeah, you run out. Yeah, it's really it yeah, really yeah, 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 yeah. I really run out because you can just pour it on your pasta, oh, God, put a bit of olive oil on it, and that's it. Chuck your you know prawns or your vegetables in, and it's all done. So, an amazing product, and I just. Um, and a lot of people enjoy eating them as much as like I like making them. Yeah. If you go on our website, you see the reviews. When, when customers mm -hmm. like something, and obviously you exactly. enjoy making it, then, then that's worth it, isn't it? If you don't sell anything, there's a problem. But you exactly. sell them, you've got the oils, the yeah. jams, they're nice everything. Range. Yeah, they, they, they're lovely and they, they are not like. They are not similar to anything on the market, mm -hmm. and um, so that's why I said to people, just try it, yeah. and uh, everyone will try it, they yeah. come back. You know? Well, that's, that's what and that's what you see, because on our website, these festivals are awesome for that, because exactly. you can come along, you can try it, you can go mild, you can go yeah. hot.